In this laboratory, we research fire safety on board aircraft. Fires on aircraft are too common an occurrence. Most of them are minor and are controlled pretty easily, but many have got the potential to become catastrophic. If an in-flight fire gets out of control, the accident experience is that there will only be around 15 minutes before control of the aircraft is lost. One of our big concerns is fires in the hidden parts of the cabin, the regions that the passenger never gets to see. The problem for these places is that a fire can get pretty big before it's detected, and getting to it in flight can be really difficult for the cabin crew. Many of these fires could have been avoided with better awareness of some of our research findings. So this video shows research results showing what can happen in maintenance that might result in a fire and how these problems might be avoided. However, this video is to provide background information and is not a substitute for following your company procedures, which is essential. A lot of what we have to say is about the electrical wiring system, but it's wider than that. There's been a lot of work in recent years to reduce the risks of fire, but there's still more to be done. Recent research has highlighted the risks posed by contaminated thermal acoustic insulation. Through research, we now know that dust and lint found in aircraft can be ignited by low-level electrical arcs from faulty wiring. Furthermore, the rate of fires does not appear to be reducing. Wiring best practice is well known, but not always effectively carried out. That's why it's essential to follow the procedure of your organisation exactly. This is not an area to use individual judgement, because the full consequences may not be fully apparent. In summary, for wiring, it comes down to clean and protect as you go. Because it's not often appreciated how easily the wiring system can be damaged. Extreme care should be taken with wiring, and procedures must be followed rigorously. When undertaking a procedure, there must be minimal disturbance of adjacent wiring. It must be returned to normal configuration in accordance with applicable maintenance instructions. Even minor displacement of wiring can damage insulation, leading to subsequent arcing or failure. Use extreme care to protect wiring from mechanical damage by tools. Do not allow debris to contaminate wiring. Once contaminated, it's very difficult to remove. Cabling faults leading to electrical arcs are a real concern. It's possible to have a significant arc without the breaker popping. This can ignite the wiring insulation and can lead to dust and lint igniting, causing an in-flight fire. We've replicated the effect in the laboratory with dust and lint collected from an aircraft operated by a major airline. It's not just dust and lint that's of concern. The thermal acoustic insulation itself can become contaminated. This report found contamination weighing more than 160 grams per square metre on an aircraft. The contamination was from dried corrosion inhibiting compounds, cotton fibres, mineral particles, metal fragments and insects. There was a fire, fortunately on the ground. In-flight entertainment is a frequent cause of problems. It's advisable to match the cable standards of the airframe manufacturer when working with these systems. Lighting is a common problem. Wiring in the vicinity of hydraulic systems is a particular concern to avoid any contamination from hydraulic fluid. It is not generally realised that even fire-resistant hydraulic fluids will readily burn under certain conditions. Oxygen is a constant concern. A minor fire becomes a major fire if oxygen is involved. Care needs to be taken with cleaning materials. This aircraft was destroyed on the ground by a technician using non-flammable chemicals in an aerosol can, but the propellant ignited. This 747 was destroyed when an electrical arc ignited cleaning rags. 
There's been much research about fire safety, but it counts for little if it doesn't make a difference in the real world. My closing message is that aviation is so safe because good procedures have been developed and it's crucial that they are followed exactly.